Endogenic forces are those which are inside or beneath the surface of the earth and exogenic forces are those which are on the surface of the earth. This causes two types of endogenic forces, slow forces and sudden forces. Slow forces, as you can see, cause the formation of mountains. This is how the Himalayas were formed. Sudden forces result in volcanic eruptions and earthquakes. Now, exogenic forces act on the surface of the earth and these are visible to us. For example, the movement of wind, rivers and sea waves change the surface of the land. Mountains become plateaus over time. Rivers erode mountains to form valleys and plains. So we learnt about how mountains, volcanoes and earthquakes result from endogenic forces, whereas exogenic forces erode mountains over time into plateaus, plains and valleys.